Hi, Coach Catherine here from Full Circle Coaching and Consulting. If you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so that you know when we've got new videos coming out. So how many of us in practice or how many of you out there feel like patients are floating around? They're booking their own appointments based on what they think. They really, you don't know when they're coming in. You may not even realize that they aren't coming in anymore. So a lot of this has to come down to what are your systems in the office? Do you have a system that takes that patient right from that first contact, which is quite often the, the initial phone call, through to their progress exam or progress report? Do you know what pieces you want the patient to understand and know right from that first visit? So what's firstly important is making sure that phone call covers everything that you need it to cover, meaning does the patient know how long the appointment's going to take? Do they have an expectation of what the cost is? Is your front desk staff doing a great job of making that patient feel welcome as well as giving them the, ne the necessary information before they come in the office? Then the new patient exam, it's not only uh, an exam for you to try and figure out how to help this patient. A big piece of the new patient exam is about helping the client or the patient realize and understand what chiropractic is, what your office has to offer, what the expectations they can have of your office, as well as what the expectations of you may have, or your office has of them as a client. So that they're, everybody is what we call management by agreement. So everybody understands what's expected, what the next steps forward followed by a report of findings. Being really clear on what's important for you to communicate to that patient is key. So once you know what you want to communicate, then having a system for communicating it, including what they can expect as far as a care plan. What is appropriate for them? What's their commitment level? What's the financial commitment level? As well as when is their progress exam or progress report scheduled. What this does is gives the client a very clear path as to right from that first phone call, what the process is, what's to be expected, what the time and financial commitment is, so that they can go in with their eyes wide open, excited to start chiropractic, and knowing what to expect. A lot of times what we find is offices aren't doing a great job of communicating these pieces to clients for various reasons. One, it just may be there isn't a system. You don't even know what you want to say to the client. You're not even sure what the important pieces are. Or it might be that there's a piece of you that for some reason is afraid to tell the patient what they need. Are you afraid you don't? they don't value it? Are you afraid you don't value it? Are you afraid they may not like you? So there's all of those pieces that can come into play too. And by making sure you're clear on what the patient needs, what's important that they understand, and then the commitment level both on your part as the office and their part as the client gives everybody a very concise, clear steps forward. So they leave their report of findings with ideally the series of adjustments booked that you have determined is appropriate from your exam and any of the tests that you do, right up to their progress exam, progress report. A lot of offices we find don't follow through with the progress exam and progress report. So then what happens is quite often you lose, patients disappear. They don't even know when the checkup's coming. They don't know what to expect. So as soon as the symptoms or the pain disappears, they're gone. As opposed to the opportunity to make sure you've done a re-exam and the opportunity to let them know where they've, how far they've come, where they're at, and what the possible next steps are. So really the key to, again, all of this is making sure we have solid systems in place 
for our phones, our new patient exams, our report of findings, our special appointment, our progress exam and progress report. And by doing this, you have one, made sure that client has a clear understanding of what their expectations are. Two, made sure that you have done a really good job at educating the patient so that they're making an informed choice about the level of care they would like to have in your office. And most importantly, you've given them the chance to experience the best outcomes they could have because they're not falling away from care because they didn't actually even know what the care plan should be and they're booking appointments based on their own thoughts, which as a client, they don't really know what they need. So if you think any of this resonates with you, if you, you know, can see some areas where you definitely could upgrade your systems, please give us a call. We would love to help you. Go to the website, Full Circle Coaching and Consulting, and reach out. We would love to guide you and support you. Thank you.